Here we have a Dell Inspiron 2350, 2014 Haswell model, i7. We're going to open up and explore the insides. We're going to have something soft to put your item on, so that when you move it around, it doesn't scratch or damage your item. We're going to start off with nine screen flat as all the, the motherboard and most of the components are on the back. Sorry about the cat. To remove the back cover, we're going to have to remove every screw on the back. There are nine screws on the back. We're going to first remove the screw on the white panel. Removing the screw reveals your RAM. It's an easy access door, so you can access your RAM. Remove the RAM. We push the two clips away from the RAM, and the RAM tilts up, and you take it out. Now that we have removed all the screws, we're going to need a prime tool to pry around the sides. There's not many clips holding it down, there's actually only two clips, and the other things holding it down is the USB port, how it sticks out of it, such as These two are the speakers, that's the RAM slot, that's the hard drive, there's four screws holding the hard drive down.
That's the fan. Wireless card, CPU. Graphic card, graphic card RAM, one gig each. So that's one gig, two gig graphic card there. Now we flip to back to remove the back cover of the LCD screen. There's a little small gap hinge there. Just put your priming tool in and it pops open. And then just use the priming tool and go around it. It's relatively pretty simple. And it comes off pretty easy as there's no plastic clips holding it down. There's a piece of plastic there, oh rubber sorry, you're going to have to push the rubber, you have to squeeze the rubber or, actually, or, or else it will block your cover from moving back. So now I'm going to flip it around to show you the back. So that's the wireless, that's the microphone, web camera, microphone, and another wireless on the left and right. That's your touch panel on the front, that's your power button, that's your backlight, and that's the backlight controller. That's your LCD cable. And that's it. This is pre relatively pretty simple. Everything you need to access is at the back. By removing a screws, you re reveal everything. The CPU is a laptop CPU, so if you want to replace the CPU, you can. But there's not much CPUs out there that's greater than that, or even worth the price. Thanks for watching.